I know it's just a cartoon, but even with that in mind, Bosco's Dog Race was not very comfortable to watch. This was a 1932 Warner Brothers cartoon. It's directed by Hugh Harmon, with a voice cast including Johnny Murray as Bosco and Rochelle Hudson as Honey. And it starts off with Bosco and his dog Bruno by a campfire. They're enjoying the outdoors. And then Bruno goes after a squirrel. And we have this beautifully animated chase scene. The pacing is really great. I really got the sense that Bruno was going after that animal and Bosco was trying to go after him. And it was chaotic, but it worked very, very well. And then Bruno sees a sign for a whippet race. And he then, well, I was going to say he then trains Bruno to get ready for the race. But actually, he basically tortures him. That might be slightly too strong a word, but Bruno looks miserable. He looks like he's in pain. And as I said, I know it's just a cartoon, but it's still difficult to watch. I am the kind of person who will cry in an animated film if it involves animals in any way, but not usually with Bosco cartoons. Not that I cried at this one, but it, it wasn't pleasant. And it would have been different if Bruno had been enthusiastic. It would have worked so much better if Bosco had shown Bruno the sign, as he does when... When Bruno sees the Whippet Race sign, he actually looks back at the camera with this look of fear on his face, and it's heartbreaking. But if Bruno had maybe been excited about it, maybe Bosco had pointed out the cash prize to him. Obviously, it's a cartoon. Dogs could read in cartoon worlds if they want to. Bruno could have been excited about it, and he could have enjoyed the training, and then we would have the race. And I won't say what happens with the race, but it wasn't very interesting. The race lasted... A about the last two minutes of the seven-ish minute cartoon, so it takes a long time to get there. But I didn't, I didn't enjoy it. It was okay to begin with. It was absolutely fine to begin with. And then about halfway through, the training or torture of Bruno begins. And if he was just excited about it, it would have been a much, much different experience. I don't know why they decided to go down this route of Bruno looking terrified and in pain because it's not pleasant. So I didn't like it. The animation itself is not too bad. I don't have any issues with the actual animation quality. It looks quite good. The animation of the characters is really good. The pacing isn't incredible. It did take a long time to even introduce the concept of the race. And then the training or torture took up a little bit of time. Then the race at the end. It's not great. It's not a brilliant narrative structure. But it's not, it's not horrendous. But Bruno's facial expressions are just horrific. His body language, it's horrible. I mean, if they were attempting to portray a dog who looked pained and terrified, then they did a great job of it. So I guess that works in their favour. But no, I didn't. I didn't enjoy it. And if you're a dog person or an animal person, even if you're a Bosco fan, I'd say proceed with caution because it's not a comfortable watch. <laughs>